hello dominance welcome to my channel if you are new here my name is alberta and my channel name is dominant tv i make videos on different types of recipes and sometimes i throw in vlogs and if there's the type of content you want please stay tuned okay so today i'm making another recipe i'm making mashed potatoes okay so i'm going to show you how i make my mashed potatoes if you want to know how i make it then stay tuned so i'm going to start by peeling my potatoes and then wash them properly and then soak it into water because I would I don't need it now so I have to soak it in water so that um, the color doesn't change so after getting my potatoes out of the way I'm going to put my water on fire Yes, so at this point I'm going to add my salt because I love to add my salt here at this point. Others do not add salt here, they add it when they are mashing their potatoes. But I just prefer it here. Then I'm just going to cover it for it to boil. Okay, so I'm going to add onions and garlic. It's actually optional. If you don't want it, do not add it. But it gives your mashed potato flavor. Okay, so I'm going to cut them into pieces and then put it in my pot filled with water because i want the onions to be very soft okay so i first of all cook it before adding my potatoes so that when it's cooked it will be easy to mash i don't know if you get it yes it gives the water some kind of flavor and then it can penetrate the potatoes <laughs> Okay, so my potatoes are ready to go in now as you can see the onions and garlic are about 70 percent cooked okay so by the time the potatoes and everything is cooked it's gonna be extremely soft and it will be easy to mash my potatoes are ready you don't want it to be extremely mushy okay else you're gonna end up with a watery mesh potatoes For easy mashing, I'm going to mash it right away while it's still hot. It makes it easy for you to mash. Okay, yeah, so basically that's what I'm doing. Guys, um, I usually do not measure whenever I'm making this, okay, when I'm adding the other ingredients. But for the sake of this video, I'm going to leave every ingredient, the measurements of every ingredient in the description box below. So I just added my butter. It just came out from the refrigerator that's why it is proving stubborn here but anyways the heat from the potatoes will melt it so yeah after getting that out of the way i'm going to add my black pepper it is also optional okay just to give my mashed potatoes a bit of heat okay so you're gonna mix it properly together i don't know i'm so excited <laughs> because i love mashed potatoes guys and the recipe it's so simple anybody at all can do this so it's time to add my milk so in order not to end up with a watery consistency you have to add your milk gradually okay so yes, that's exactly what I'm doing here. So you can use whole milk like I'm using, but mine is high fat whole milk, okay? Or you can also use heavy milk, whichever one you prefer. At this point it is red day I think it's smooth enough but if you think that it is not too smooth for you at this point 
you can go in with your hand mixer but this is perfectly okay for me so we've come to the end of this video guys you can make this it is very simple try today and let me know how it turns out for you thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed it give me a thumbs up and also subscribe to this channel if you haven't already thank you so much see you in my next video and yes don't forget to share to others bye